Don't forget to like the video, share, and subscribe to the channel. If you like the content, if you're a hater, just click the X at the right of your screen. If you want the access to exclusive content, follow us over there onto Patreon. All of the links to access my content are in the description box below. What is up, you guys? Thank you so much for being a part of my channel. I really and truly appreciate each and every one of you guys. We're going to go ahead and jump straight into the energy surrounding you in this time. What you need to know, what you need to be aware of, and what you can expect. All right, let's see what the energy in your environment is in this next 24. The energies in your environment. Cleaning something up, and yes, it's a big deal, okay? Gains, okay? Why do I feel like you're the cleanup crew, okay? For some of you... It's like, I feel like you may be running around trying to get certain things squared away. Um, I feel like there's also something about a reaction. Uh, for some of you, I feel like there's something going on in your place of employment, your job, your work. Y'all know, I'm going I'm gonna, I'm gonna to tell y'all something. A lot of these readings have been coming up saying something about a co- parenting situation i don't know if i've made it clear to you a lot of the time that can be a co-worker so for your situation to make sense whenever i say co-parenting go ahead and switch it with co-worker if you know that that is not your case if you don't have a co-parenting situation because we've been seeing a lot of this like this guy running trying to keep up trying to keep everything going checking on the stats checking on you know all the things this is giving cleanup crew okay and i'm seeing like this is involving two different people all right um things are happening fast for you i feel like it's almost like a cycle something that you feel like you have to constantly do you're having to constantly stay on top of things constantly staying on top of your work environment um i feel like you have also gotten some kind of insight as of recently about how you can fix a, a situation at work with your job or with your yeah, this is trying to fix something, get something in order so you don't have to, I don't know if this is work as hard, do as much. There's some kind of insight that you've recently gotten that is about to bring in a lot of peace, a lot of happiness, and this is also giving something that you've been manifesting for quite some time. This is something that you've been actively speaking out. It's almost like getting the toxic energy away from you, getting yourself to a place where you don't feel like you're always having to catch up or always having to correct something, okay? I feel like for those of you who are wondering if you're close, I see, I see you are, okay? I'm also getting that you are on the right path. You are doing the right thing um especially for all people who are involved i've got all out there like literally all people involved for some of you i'm about to tell you something for those of you who practice actively practice there is something that you have um been doing or trying to manifest okay if it has not been uh manifesting into physical reality as of recently it's because you have not focused on the situation and all involved okay um something very specific is coming through about that it's like for the benefit of all parties or that there's something there's something along the lines with that that you need to be aware of when you are manifesting this is what has been keeping something from just like just out of reach or just to where you're feeling like you're constantly having to run around in a cycle like on some kind of freaking hamster wheel it's because you are not saying i heard with harm to none and for the benefit of all or something like that okay um there's something that you are trying to achieve that you have not been able to achieve because of that all right but there is something that we've got a cycle a reoccurring cycle that's been going on for some of you in regards to your i keep hearing boss but this is like your job this is also having to stay on top of stats quotes making sure that you are on top of your things because you already know there's somebody here who is actively watching you hoping that you slip up so they can slide in and save the day okay um i feel like there is somebody still who's kind of lurking 
I feel like this person is actually starting to try to turn their back to this situation. They want to turn their back to the situation because of the fact that you are staying on task and on target. Okay. I feel like there is somebody here who may have been like coming for you or trying to stir you up or to throw you off or someone who's basically been burdening the process, slowing down a process that this person even wants peace now. Okay. I feel like the reason that this person wants peace right now is because you have not missed a step. You haven't missed a step you haven't missed a beat. They can't get anything on you. And I feel like they've, this person's been trying. I feel like they're, this person is holding on. There's one thing left that this person is hung, hanging on to. Okay. But I see that they do want to change this dynamic with you. Okay. Do not think just because they want to change the dynamic with you that they, they still don't hate your ass. They still hate your ass. Mainly because you're giving somebody <laughs> a reason to panic. Specifically because they have dropped the ball in some type of way. And something that may have been complained about or is being looked into in this time. They're really worried about it being found out or being observed in some type of way. Um, I feel like this is somebody here who feels like it's going to be best for them to kind of sneak away from a situation. Hoping that if they start moving in a different direction or get involved in a different project, something won't be looked at, won't be observed. Okay, um, they the reason they're doing this is because they do not know how to solve this issue, this dilemma that maybe they've made. I feel like this could definitely deal with some kind of mishandling of... This isn't giving mishandling of resources. This is kind of giving mishandling of information. Okay. I feel like somebody was over here being sneaky, doing underhanded, shady shit that's being observed in this time. Really funny. 777. Um, I feel like this is something that this person is used to doing. There is somebody here who is used to doing a specific thing. Um, and they do this in cycles. They do this on repeat. But I feel like you have really had it with a specific individual who keeps playing childish games, being childish, um, to where I feel like instead of just allowing this person to continue with the shenanigans, it's like you have decided to become more active, okay? By staying on your feet, staying on your toes, um, paying attention, this is actually, it's freaking this person out. You're scaring somebody, okay? Um, I feel like this person may, if they are um, spiritually inclined, they have also been getting some kind of vision um, as to where like they know that they're about to get in some kind of trouble because of some kind of back and forth cyclical activity that this person is doing. It's like something that they do on repeat. You've seen it, okay? Because you've seen it, this person has been on your tail hoping that they can find something on you or get you to slip up or get you so busy and so burdened down that you don't have time to look into something. But I feel like you've gotten so used to being in the swing, like there's something about being in the swing of things. You've gotten so used to having to cover your ass or handle certain things that you're, this isn't even affecting you anymore, okay? It may have affected you in the past, but you have learned how to go with the flow of the situation and stay in defense. You're like, this person want to keep playing with me. I'm going to give them something to play with, okay? Um, I feel like this person here is uh, really nervous in this next 24 hours because of something that they feel like is being observed that is being uncovered. I feel like this is the same type of, or this is the same person who's been trying to put so much burden on you, hoping that you would walk away or that it would make you put something down down or leave something alone but I feel like it's doing the opposite it's almost like no nah, I'm running a marathon I got this okay um somebody's funny look this is definitely talking about work this is talking about job this is talking about somebody here that um they do this constantly there's a contract with a specific individual that they keep doing the same thing and it's like causing some kind of chaos and having there's something about people having to keep up with something 
that is causing some kind of loss of finances or loss of energy, too much time being spent on a situation, too much energy being um, distributed in areas where it really shouldn't be. Okay, you could be dealing with a Virgo or an Aquarius with the social media look it's self-care but it's, with the social media thing here this is something that is definitely being talked about i feel like this person is trying to keep their head down in this time because if this is like an office set, situation set up there's a lot of people involved um this is something that maybe it could have been handled previously between you and whoever this is if this is a co-worker whatever but i feel like there's either there's something about too much time passing or too much has been lost um, to where somebody else's, a third party is having to step in and handle a situation, okay? With all of this, like, throwing your hands back, throwing your hands up to it, I don't feel like you're throwing your hands up in a way that it's like you're tired of it, you're ready to just, like, <laughs> walk out, whatever. I don't see that's the type of energy. I feel like there is something that's coming in in this next 24 that is going to give you some form of relief, Okay, um, something that you have possibly gotten into a cycle of juggling. I feel like you're actually going to be able to put it down. It is some kind of wish fulfillment, but for some of you, <laughs> I feel like by the time you put this down or once you this person comes in with, you know, the go ahead to put something down, you're not going to even know what to do with yourself at this point because you've gotten so used to the repetitive, like, crap that you've had to deal with okay like it's big deal stuff it's like um in some way you have to sign off on something or sign some kind of paperwork all right um and I feel like maybe you haven't been able to sign off on a specific thing because there's somebody here who is dragging their feet playing these games, going back and forth with something because they don't want to fix it. There's somebody here who doesn't want to fix something. Um, <laughs> they would prefer to chunk something up as a loss than to fix it. I feel like you are definitely in the energy of making sure that it's handled regardless of how much work, how much effort you have to put in. Whoever it is that is your coworker, whoever this is that you're working with, you're dealing with on the regular with the situation that's dragging their feet. They have no intention of fixing the situation, okay? They would prefer to just like have it pushed under the rug chunk it up to a loss and continue to do whatever it is that they've been doing okay um i do see a little bit of shady energy here so for some of you i feel like um you may be pulling somebody in to look at certain documents in this next 24 hours and then i don't really feel like you're really be trying to be petty or trying to be messy i feel like you know this person may have actually thrown some kind of shade your way and the way that you clear this up is by you know exposing um <laughs> per our last email i don't know this is almost like um You've had to go back and forth with the person to no avail. It's like you feel like you are beating a dead horse, telling this person the same thing and they're not listening, they're not getting it. And I don't even feel like it's that they're not getting it. It's just that they don't want to look into it. They want to, um, they want it to be, they want this, to, there's, there's something about a loss here. Why does this person want this to be a loss? Why does this person want this to be? Look, you're in the energy. You're gaining shit. This person wants it to be a chunk it up to a loss. Five of, or I'm giving, I'm seeing five of pentacles. Three of pentacles, two of pentacles, five of pentacles. Why is this person cool with losing whatever this is? That's too many. Why is this person cool with losing whatever this is? Transformation, transition. Because they know that they are, look, they know that something is over. I'm getting something about their reign is over their reign is over okay there's somebody here who you may be working with who they need to feel important they need to feel like they have something leverage in some type of way over somebody's head and i feel like the somebody is you okay um i feel like some of you like you've just gotten so used to having to deal with this person and i feel that 
the time of where you were having to crunch, do double time, double work, whatever that is. I feel like that's coming to an end specifically because something that was like all of this that's been going on behind the scenes or not being observed by you know the public or by people is actually being seen in this time okay this person is freaking out because it's being seen um they didn't expect for it to come out this way this person has gotten away with this for so long that they you know would prefer to chunk it up to a loss than to do anything about it it just is what it is okay they need to feel like they are in control of something okay why is this giving the energy of demotion? Somebody's about to get demoted. Okay. Because in a few months, like, that's legitimately what's happening. Move. Okay, so, um, this person is about to be forced out of the way. I feel like they did not want to move. They, they did not want to change. But it's happening regardless. Because there's somebody who is in a place of power who is coming down and kind of forcing them out of the way. All right? I feel like this person may try to act like they're leaving because of some kind of physical relocation. They're going to try to make it seem like they're not being forcibly removed. Um, I almost feel like they may be getting the option in some type of way because of something that is discovered. There was more stuff going on behind the scenes than whatever this person was trying to push off. I just want you to know, okay? Um, for some of you, you know this because you know that this person is shady. You know that they can't tell the truth to save their life. And it's like you have just, you know, come to expect it from this individual. What's really crazy right here is I feel like um, the boss or whoever is, they're going to give this person the option. I just heard leave without pay, okay? I feel like there's a situation going on where somebody may be given an option to vacate right now, leave, do whatever, to leave. And if they choose to try to not leave, they will have the police called on them. There's something about, like, a public closing out of a situation a public closing out of a person i don't if, if you've been wondering if this person is going to stay and continue you know whatever it is that they've been doing this entire time like possibly pinning people against each other that energy is being eclipsed out of your work environment Okay, it's definitely being eclipsed out of the work environment. And this is like giving the type of energy where it's like they have the opportunity to leave without kicking and screaming or they can leave kicking and screaming in handcuffs type deal. Okay, either way, I feel like you are getting to move into a more peaceful state. You're about to start seeing your work environment become... Like, it's almost like the twi the Twilight Zone. It's going to be completely different than what it is that you are used to dealing with in your place of employment, okay? And it's almost like, I feel like you may even be like, i got way too much energy. What am I going to do with this, okay? You're going to be productive like you always are. But I feel like for some of you, um, you've gotten so used to doing, look, I'm seeing four and one. You may have done four specific jobs in, like, you've got one job title or something of the sort, but you do four different things for other people or for this person. Like, this person has kept you on the go, keep you constantly moving, hoping that, you know, you drop the ball somewhere so they have something to run and tell. But you did so good in that energy. This person never expected that shit from you. They never expected Because they know that they couldn't do it. So it's like if they give you all these tasks, if they try to burden you so much, you're eventually going to drop the ball. But you got into the cycle of it. Um, you're like, no, this is a warm-up. You don't know me, okay? Like, uh, you have taken something on as a personal project to make sure that you do. <clears throat> For some of you, you have even been taking work home with you. Okay, some of you work from home. But it feels like taking work home with you to make sure that you stay on top of everything so they can't they can't get nothing, okay? They can't get nothing on you because it's like this person has been actively trying to do this. They're, this is done, okay? They can't, there's something, they're, they're hitting a brick wall in this time and like bouncing back and looking like, where did this brick wall come from, okay? 
Um, I feel like it's being made incredibly apparent to the people who are around in the vicinity, in the office, what's been going on the entire time. And it kind of feels like the uh, administration is about to force somebody out. Okay, this is also going to leave room for something to open up as well. Like, I feel like they are going to try to fill some kind of position in house. There's something about filling a position in house after someone uh, vacates the premise. I don't know why we're getting all that. Vacates. Okay, leaves the situation. What do they need to know? Next 24. I guess you just need to know. If you were wondering the timing, it says a few months, all right? We've got five of wands. I am the architect of my life. I build its foundation and choose its contents. Like, you have a, you have more control. This, that person hates you. <laughs> they hate you. You're coming into a place of control. Like, I feel like um, certain job title like a, a job title is being stripped from this individual that's all that that is to it okay and it may be boosting your ego a little bit okay we've got um queen of wands i feed my spirit i train my body i focus my mind it is my time okay what's this other one and five of cups look change go ahead and embrace this change it says i am at peace with who i am as a person this person tried to make you um Question yourself, question your integrity, question your morals, question whether you were good enough for the position, good enough, period, okay? Somebody really tried you, okay? And they're being forcibly removed from your environment. Um, I feel like you're not going to have to deal with this person anymore. Whoever's been giving you shit in the office is about to be... I, I keep wanting to say hazed out. It feels like somebody is being pushed out okay look i want to see do they do they recognize that they're being pushed out does this person recognize they're being pushed out <laughs> they're trying to act like they don't see it no not me look pack your shit and get out oh death transition it's okay so what's going on in this next one this person is shocked they're shook they're shocked and they know that there is no coming back from whatever this is, okay? So, there may have been something that was uncovered in the office that's a really big deal. Um, bigger than whatever it was that was your problem to begin with or something that you kept feeling like you had to clean up after this person. I feel like there's a hell of a lot more that this person wasn't doing. Um, like, I don't know if they claim they had certain credentials that they didn't have. And they're just dragging their feet trying to waste time. But the, what's crazy is they're wasting the company's time. They're wasting um, resources. Okay. And it's almost like burdening a company. There's somebody here who is finding out about this and like how they feel about being pushed out. They're shocked. Okay. They're shocked. But I, I don't... I, they see... They're trying to ignore the being pushed out part and trying to make it seem like it's their choice that they're leaving because of their own you know free will they're trying to make it seem like that's what it is that they're choosing to do but no nah, no nah. that's a hot mess they're being forced out somebody's being forced out they know it but they're trying to make it seem like they've got something better that they can be occupying their time with okay anyways that is what i have got for you guys and i will see you later make sure that y'all send me y'all's questions for those of you who are on tier two and on tier four um questions um or angel oracles you know what's on y'all's tier okay before the 15th so i can go ahead and get all that out to you guys anyways i love you so very much and i will see you guys later bye